my name is Tony Martin, and I started off really, you know, becoming very creative at the age of eight. Um, it started off with music, uh, saxophone, uh, piano, keyboard, things like that. Um, and I had an art teacher in 12th grade that kind of um, inspired me and he told me that I should do my senior project based around me and my artwork. So I did a senior portrait and he entered me into the Houston University uh, art competition and I really took it uh, with a grain of salt. I didn't care. Um, and then when we got there, I won first place um, with a portrait. Um, there were scholarships involved and I just, I didn't take it. Um, I actually failed every art class I've been in, but sell successfully on a regular basis. Um, I had kind of a, an, an epiphany that happened probably about a month ago, and I quit my job. I was a highly successful executive assistant with a company um, that offered a lot of, uh, a lot of promise, and I just kind of one day got up, went into his office and said, I quit. I love you, but I quit um, because I kind of figured um, I didn't that I didn't have enough time to put towards art. I, unbeknownst to a lot of people, you know, I lived in an apartment on a floor for a year working four jobs that I did not like. Um, I would come home and paint till three in the morning um, and then wake up at six and go to work. And it was difficult, um, but it worked because it's what I loved and it's what drove me, it's what kept me sane. Um, but once you realize that, you know, this is what you love and this is what you want to do, um, money will come. Just have the courage, believe in yourself, and take that risk. You can always find a job. This is Dallas. We have one of the best economies um, in the world thus far. So um, I took a risk. I said I quit and I went for work and it's panned out and you know even though you might go home one day and you know maybe not have money to go feed your cat at least you're doing something that makes you happy in this world in the end if you're not doing what makes you happy people I believe um, aren't, aren't going to respect you and see you for the true light that you are because life is hard already and um, so do what makes you happy